away from my house. So we will go ahead and take a look inside this thrift store to see what kind of goodies they have and what we can score on. This thrift store is called Enviro Plus and it cleans used furniture and they clean recycled furniture. So it's a furniture store, guys, that we will definitely be going into. Hey guys, and I thought that we would actually be doing something different for today and that I would actually vlog with you guys and go out and do some thrifting and show you guys the kind of stores that we have in my area. And you know, we can thrift all the time. I love thrifting. Thrifting so much fun because you can get really great finds from a thrift store. As you can tell, people are walking in and out of the store. But um, I don't want to talk too long because you never know. You might find something that someone else likes as well. And you might not get the opportunity to get it if their hands are on it first. Um, but I'm really excited to go ahead and take you out for a little ride with me. And, you know, showcase kind of the things that we have here in our neck of the woods. And I hope that you enjoy this video and that... We can continue to vlog together things that I do on a daily. We can go thrifting, we can go on adventures, do a whole bunch of stuff. Let's get right into it and get in there. So let's go. All right, guys. So let's go into our first find, and that is at Enviro Plus. Let's get in there and go, guys. It looks like they're getting a new hot delivery right now. So they have a whole bunch of selection of furniture, which is pretty cool. Different types of prices too. So that's really awesome. Oh, this couch is really cute. It's like flamish sort of. And for 225, that's not bad. We have end tables and much, 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 much more, you guys. So let's go take a look over here. And they have all these dressers. Oh, this trunk is cute. These fish bowls are really cute. Books, books, and more books, guys. I love thrifting. Sometimes you can get really great books in here and hard copies that cost a lot of money. Look at all the records. Oh my god. Good old vinyl. Hey guys, so I just got out of Enviro Plus and we did see a couple of items in there. I tried to get into the very, very back where we were able to go ahead and see like all the storage, everything that they had. Unfortunately, I'm wearing sandals today and because I don't have proper footwear, I'm going to have to come back and we'll go ahead and do a viewing of all the stuff that they have in the back that people really don't get to see. Let's go on to our next adventure and our next adventure is the ReStore. The proceeds go to people that have lost homes in very tragic disasters and they need somewhere to go. So people like us that buy off them, it goes to the proceeds of purchasing the lumber and the materials needed to construct these homes for the less unfortunate, which I think is absolutely wonderful. Make sure that you are always giving back and paying it forward um, because, you know, what you give, you get in return. We're definitely going to take a sneak peek on another video upcoming of the back end of Enviro Plus where they steam clean all the furniture and all the furniture that comes in and, and all that great stuff. So excited to do that. So let's just get on our next journey because it is super, super hot out and I'm sweltering right now in this car because all the windows are closed because I'm super afraid to just broadcast openly. People might might think I'm crazy talking to myself on my phone. <laughs> All right, so let's get to the other side, guys. All right, guys, so we are almost over at the ReStore, and let's go check out what kind of goodies they have in this store. Siren, siren. Oh cool, these soccer balls are so pretty. Christmas stuff. Oh wow. Love it. They have doors. Oh, that's a cute little bed for a kid. Love 
love it. And they have outdoor furniture, which I'm gonna get to. I love that pink coconut. Gotta go check that out. But this is what the brief store looks like. And we'll keep going around, guys, just to check out bed frames. They have an array of bags, pillows, comforters. I actually love this pillow. I'm gonna buy it. I think it's really cute. Out of all the pillows, this is the cutest. And it's got a slip so they can wash it. Frog thermometer. That's kind of different for $6. Would I get it? No, but it's cute. Okay guys, see those chairs right there? They are pretty. I can't wait to go and check those out. Hopefully no one gets them before we get there. But that's how it is. You snooze, you lose. I'm not entirely too sure what these are, but they are cute. They look like little stoves. Hmm. Maybe those are like vases or something? Guys, if you know, let me know in the comments below. I'd love to know what they are. Golf shirts. Anybody need a purple golf shirt? Let me know. There's tons. And it's reduced at 75% off. Golf clubs. And right here, this is what I'm kind of interested in. What are these? These are cute. What are they? They're Ashland chalkboards. They're $29.99. How much are they selling them for? $15. Too much, guys. Too much for my blood. And it's kind of cheaply made, so we'll put that back. What's this? What's that? It's different. It looks like a card holder or something. Hmm. Okay, so these chairs are super cute. $450. No way. $450 for that set, guys. Would you even pay that? I wouldn't. Absolutely not. More books, you guys. Here, what's this? Oh, cool. This would be good for your water tank for spillage, but it's $30. $35. No way I'm paying 35 bucks. And there is a light section in here, which is rather cool. Wow, this is super pretty for a DIY. $15. It has that pretty, pretty Edison bulb light with the chrome finishing for $15, guys. This is actually a really good score. I love it. And they have them brand new in the box right here. 15 bucks. I mean, I don't know. Can you get a white light? It looks like it's a yellow light, but I absolutely love this. It is so adorable. Oh my God. I don't know why. I'm just impressed with it. I need to get it, I think. And they have clothes. Huh, look at these dolphins. And chairs. And tables. And a whole bunch of stuff. Tell me what you think of this store, guys. Do you absolutely love the Restore? Would you come in? Are you enjoying this video? Let me know in the comments below. And there's furniture, you guys. Lots of chairs. Lots of different knickknacks everywhere. Love it. So our last and final stop for today is going to our trusty Value Village and checking out what we can find at our favorite little thrifty spot. And there are more thrifty spots that I will be taking you guys eventually. Just right now, for some apparent reason, my AC is not working and the temperature is 29 degrees outside. So, yeah. Here we are at Ali Village. Let's go take a look. Let's get into the Value Village. <laughs> Let's see what kind of cool finds we can get today in store. This is what it looks like, guys, just so you can see. 
We have a lot of art definitely to display. And I think it's really cool that we have a lot of art. I absolutely love that one that says love, love, love. Actually, it's not really cheap. It's only $12.99. It's not bad. So I might come back and get that, but maybe someone else might steal it before I get there. Let's keep looking, guys. These mugs are super cute. I love them. They have a lot of cookware and all these different appliances. Really cool. They have a whole array of books. So many books. And a great steal, guys. You can get really good books in here for really, really great steals. A bunch of electronics that you can get. What's this? A human fire. These are sort of cute. I'm a sucker for Christmas. Oh, is this an Easter tree? <gasps> it is an Easter tree. How much is it? Mm, it doesn't really go that well. And it's broken. Oh, sad. How much are they selling this guy for? Anyways. $9.99. It's broken. Look at this little cute one, but I'm not getting it. <gasps> Oh, it's broken. Look, broken. It's hot there, guys. And it is in bad shape. These are Dollarama items. How much are they selling them here for? Four ninety nine. That's a pile of rubber. This is a shoe stand. That's kind of cute. For people that have, like, really nice shoes that they want to display, like Louis Vuittons or Gucci's. This is a cute little thing. It's a little bit up there. I'm just gonna pass on that. Clocks. We have pillows everywhere. Sweet dreams. Comforters galore, fabric if you need it. And they have shoes galore. Love it. Looking for a bag? Reuse something that somebody else brought here. Okay guys, so that was Valley Village. We really didn't find much, but there were some cool items. Today was really, really fun. I hope that you enjoyed today's video on our little adventure to a few thrift shops within the area. And I wanted to show you kind of what I actually picked up, and I'm sure you probably already know, but it was a pink pillow that I was like, oh my God, I need to get that pink pillow. The pink pillow is this, really cute. It's a pineapple pillow and it's pink and it looks absolutely brand new. It has a zipper slip so I could go ahead and get this wash because that's what I'm going to do. It has the slip, take that out. It has the pillow, you can wash the pillow on a gentle cycle, but it has the slip and I personally love pillows that do have slips. You can interchange your pillows, um, but yeah, I thought this was a great quality pillow. It's an outdoor pillow as well. Um, just by the feel of the fabric, but this is the pillow that I got and this pillow actually cost four dollars in total well, That is a pretty good find. This is from Boot Claire and I don't know if you are familiar with Boot Claire, but they have a very very good brand and They do a lot of home decor. So this is from Boot Claire and for four dollars from for Boot Claire item That's pretty awesome. And it's pretty big. Look. So, I mean, it's a nice outdoor pillow. I absolutely love it. This will definitely go with the theme that I'm kind of going for. I absolutely love it. What do you guys think about it? Do you love the color? What do you think of the pattern? So it's definitely gonna be um, one of my outdoor pillows. And I do have sort of an obsession with pillows. I don't know why, but I love pillows, pillow slips. You name it, I have so many pillows, it's unbelievable. That is my one item. And the only other item that I did get was this Ove light. Now this Ove light is super, super cool. It was a pendant light with gold, and this was only $15. 15, like nuts. I was so impressed with it. What I think we should do though is kind of unbox this guy because we know that the pillow is not damaged. 
Whenever I go thrifting, I always look to make sure that there's no damage at all the seams and just to make sure that it is in good working condition so that you can get a couple years out of your product. I know we're thrifting and yes, it's secondhand, but you can get brand new items at secondhand shops um, and you wouldn't believe the amount of people, I'm sure you can actually, but the amount of people that buy things, still have the tags on, don't wear it, don't like it because it's at a season and then they just throw it away um, and it goes to the thrift store. I'm gonna rip this guy open. Okay, perfect. Fingers crossed that this is not broken. $15, we will be installing this bad boy um, and I know exactly where it's gonna go. I really do need a, an overhaul of my kitchen. I'll be honest with you, it's the original cabinets, I believe, to the house. I definitely need to upgrade it. And I thought, you know, what a great spectacular showcase is to go with the brass, which we will be doing together. But for now, I just kind of wanted to put this fixture up and I will DIY this fixture and we will put it up together as well. So you can see exactly when it gets installed. We can all cheer for when the light is in. Let's hope that this glass shade is not broken. I was so surprised that they actually had like three or four of these still in the box. I previewed the display earlier, but I really want to make sure that this is not broken because I only have a couple days to return it. Oh my God. Ove is a really good company, to be honest with you. It's a Canadian based family company and they make amazing products. Oh, so these are amber lights. So they're gonna be, it's gonna be a little yellowish. Okay, so the bulb is still in, intact, guys. It's pretty much brand new, $15. Do you see it's like the Edison? Here, I'll take it out of its packet. It's probably, ta-da! It's like the Edison bulb. Cool. So that's the bulb. And... Oh my god, fingers crossed everyone, please. And then we also have the hardware kit. It comes with gloves so that you don't get fingerprints on your light fixtures. The great thing about Ove is that when it does have um, gloves, you can use them for your other fixtures. I have a lot of chandeliers in my house because I just absolutely love chandeliers. But uh, yeah, it has all the hardware and it obviously has everything. So, oh my god. So here is the pendant and it is in brass and I know you guys saw a little glimpse of it but it is absolutely gorgeous and here is the top which is brass as well so it's going to hang above the sink in the kitchen um, which is going to be super super cool so the most important right now is the shade okay so Fingers crossed that this shade is in one piece. It's in one piece, guys. So this is super sexy and I'm excited to put this in. It is super, super classy. I'm very excited this is not broken. Yay! Thank goodness. So we will be installing this cute, absolutely adorable brass light. And if you're wondering, it's called the Georgia Pendant Light. I've been worrying about that all day because I didn't want to go back. I really didn't. Ugh, what a relief, you guys. Honestly, when you get a light for $15 from a thrift store, you're like, mm. Especially how pretty this light was. Like, I am so stoked to hang this up. I'm so stoked. I don't know why this light just spoke to me, but it absolutely did. I, I just, I love it. It's wonderful. Perfect. Okay, so there it is, guys. So these are my two items that I did get. So this was $15, and this was $4. It was $19. Um, and 
it was really fun actually going and exploring with you. I think it was a lot of fun. Tomorrow I do have another outing, um, which is going to be a lot of fun. Um, I can't say too much because I do want to go ahead and vlog it and post it out to you guys. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And until then, we'll check you on the next video.